They should have never killed off Shane from The Walking Dead. I was like, why the fuck why they, would they kill off one of the best characters of a show? And he always been, only been there for like two seasons in the show. John Barthol, who played uh, Shane Walsh from The Walking Dead, you know, Rick's best friend. Why is he only in there for two seasons? Is it because of the comics? Because if they did, it's like, why would you do that in the first place? You should have changed it because, like, he was, like, one of the best characters of the show. Like, it's like killing off Jesse from Breaking Bad, which they almost did. They almost actually killed off Jesse from Breaking Bad. But they ended up changing their mind. Guess what? The show's a masterpiece. They kept him alive and shit, you know? Walt and Jesse cooking meth. You know, like... They should have the same thing with Shane. They should have never killed them off. They should have changed their mind and kept them alive throughout the whole all the seasons until, yeah, like I don't know how far the seasons, but he should have kept alive for a long, long time. Like just two seasons with Shane? Are you fucking kidding me? All, all because they're fighting over some slut named Lori that uh, got fucking pregnant and shit. Blah blah blah. Like I don't get why those two had to fight over that broad in the first place. Like it, it is so stupid. Like, it was like the dumbest shit ever. Like, I, I, I don't understand. Lori is... Lori sure got killed off in like season two. And Rick and Shane would have, you know, patched things up and changed their mind about Lori and the things and like that, you know? Also, killing off Carl was stupid as fuck also. I thought once like Rick died, I thought Carl was going to take over the show. But no, he died before fucking uh, Rick died. Carl. It's like, are you kidding me? Why are you kill off Carl? These fucking writers are so fucking shit. Like, they're even worse than the writers from fucking Better Call Saul Season 6. That's how fucking terrible these fucking clowns are, man. Like, I was so fucking pissed when they killed Shane off. Especially Carl. I'm like, why would you kill off Shane's son? Not Shane. Why would you kill off Rick's son from The Walking Dead? I, I don't get what was the logic between that. But killing off Shane was their biggest mistake they ever done for a television show. He, that was like the worst mistake ever to ever do for a TV show. I'm like, why the fuck would you do that? Plus, like in season two, how, how he's like training all these these uh these other people how to fight walkers and shit. I'm like, so I'm like it makes no sense. And then all of a sudden he started fighting Rick over. A, that fucking slut Lori. I, I don't understand the logic between that also. I'm like, are you kidding me? Why all of a sudden, out of the blue, they're gonna fight over this slut? Like, I think in between that fight, I think Lori should have just died right in between that fight or some shit like that, you know? And then those two would patch things up and they would move on from that shit. Yeah, they both have been crying about it, but still, like, it's stupid. Why you fight over this stupid broad for, man? Like, why you guys sipping over this slut? Oh, because they both fucked her. Who cares? Like, she should have she just died in season two. She should have just died right there after they fought each other or something like that. Like, her character, like, destroyed the whole show, to be fair. She was, like, ruined the whole show. And plus, she, like, dies in season three anyway. So what was the point of, of fighting over her? She dies in season three. It's like, there's no point in that whatsoever. Like, these writers are shit. They're one of the worst writers I ever seen for a television show. Like I said, they're worse than the Better Call Saul season six writers. That's how bad they are. But yeah, like Rick and Shane are basically Walt and Jesse in The Walking Dead. They're basically Walt and Jesse. And somehow, when you kill off a second best character show, you re completely ruined the whole show forever. You ruined the whole show forever after you just did that. Like, I lost so much interest in continuing to watch the show after season two, after they killed off fucking uh, Shane. I just lost so much interest in even watching it. I mean, Rick is cool. It's just that it's not, it's not the same as just Rick. You know, it's just Rick leading the team. It should be Rick and Shane leading the, the team. Because Shane was Rick's right hand man. Like, it was, it was stupid after they killed him off. Then, like, I stopped watching the show after, like, season four. That's why I stopped watching the show. Hey, too many cool characters got killed off. I gotta stop watching it. I was, I was like, fuck this shit. I ain't watch this no more. There's no Shane anymore. Like, you, you kidding me? I'm not watching this garbage anymore. Fuck this bullshit. Yeah, it was so dumb after they killed off Shane from season two. I'm like, why so early you kill off this best character of the show? 
Why so early? Two seasons? Are you kidding me? But they kill, they kill off Rick in season nine. Why he lasts so long but Shane just dies like two seasons in because they're fighting over a dumb broad. It, it, it's so dumb how they just start fighting over her and shit. It's just... She should have just died in season two when they were fighting and shit and they never would have killed kill each other. You know? Shane would have been still alive and this and that. You know? It would have been those two leading the whole uh, herd to whoop Walker ass and fight that dorky governor guy with the eye patch and that fucking douchebag with the fucking baseball bat. I think the way to end the show would, would have been Rick and Shane and the baseball bat guy. And they, all, they all end up killing each other and they all die. That's how they should end the show. And Carl's like, like, like the last guy to ever survive. I think the show should last at least seven seasons or six six or seven seasons. With the governor guy and the baseball guy, bat guy. That's it. Six, seven seasons. That's it. But somehow this show lasts like 13 seasons. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? With these fucking lamos that lasted in the show. Like, how the fuck did Carol last so long in The Walking Dead? How the hell is she still alive? Carol sucks. I mean, I don't mind Daryl, but I, I, I don't get the whole casting of the show. I don't, I don't get it. Who, 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 who he writes the show anymore? But it's just not the same about Rick and Shane, to be fair. Like, like I said, I stopped watching this shit. The last season I ever watched the show was the fourth season. That's it. I just I was like, fuck this shit. I didn't watch this no more. Too many cool characters got killed off. I was like, done. But once they killed off Shane, the show died with him. I am not fucking around. That's what I think. Once they killed him off, the show died with him. Because that was like their biggest, most embarrassing mistake they had ever done for a television show. Killing off Shane. Him and Rick shall last it till like the seventh season. The show should have ended right then and there. And they both die after... Well, all three of them die. Him... Shane, wait, Rick, Shane, and the baseball bad guy, they all kill each other, they all die, they bully each other's brains out, they all die in that same room together. That's it. That's how the show ended. And like, like only, only Carl like survives with a couple of other people, that's it. Having the crazy uh, war they have with each other. That's it. That's, that's how you're supposed to end The Walking Dead. Seven seasons, that's it. It's over. Like the final fight should have been Rick and Shane versus the baseball bad guy. That's it. Two against one, and they all die. All three of them die. After a savage fight with each other, bully charge brains and shit. But instead, that's lasts a show to like 10 to 12 seasons because, oh, because the fan base and shit. We can't cancel the show yet because of the fan base. Yeah, let's just drag it out until. Oh, it's just so stupid. One life lesson. When you're a. a TV show creator, don't drag your show out until it starts sucking ass. Please, please don't do that. If you're a creator of a TV show, don't drag it out. Okay, don't do that. Just make it show last like six, seven seasons. Don't make it drag the fuck out. Like, like this fucking show. This, like I said, this show dragged out like a fucking dead zombie. Uh, it's blood all over the fucking uh, road with his half body on the ground.